this. Make sure you click subscribe so when I upload oh, a new YouTube video, me, you never miss out on my new videos. Video. Oh, make a new video. You need to get out of the PlayStation for the great content. Make sure to do it now. Click sign up now after the country or region. Make sure to pick United Kingdom or United States. Oh goodness me, every time I see the word Andy HD, I just get extremely triggered. Oh, what is that? <laughs> alright, alright, that was the last time, I swear, there's no more triggers. It's okay, you can turn your headphones back up, it's okay. I'll be Alright guys, welcome back. So, it's been a while since I've made a video, and I don't really have an excuse for that. I just didn't feel like it, and I just remembered how it's kind of cool to like edit and stuff, so I'm like... Coming back with a a pretty heavily edited video, so yeah. So if you couldn't tell by the intro, we're gonna be taking a look at um, Andy HD. If you didn't know who that is, you probably well I don't know some of you probably do, but like he, I'll just say he's more. I wouldn't say he's clickbait, but he's definitely misleading a lot. Very misleading. Now the first point I have to make is that his titles, not only are they misleading and stuff, but the video itself is so dumb. Okay, here's an example. So he'll say like, how to get a free game on PS4, alright? So like, oh cool, I get to play like GTA or something for free on my PS4. But guess what? All he does is he goes to the free game section, not even kidding about this. He goes to the free game section and then tells you to add to the cart and then download a free game. Like, why would you do that? It's, there's no point. You don't need to do that. So can you just stop? If you go through most of his videos, you'll understand what I'm talking about here. Like, he's so misleading. Like, I don't know if I've said that enough times already. But if we wanted a free game... We would already know that you can go to the free game section of the PlayStation Store and download something. We don't need a tutorial to see how to do that. Like, most people will be clicking on the video thinking that they can get, like, a paid-for game for free, which is obviously what he wants the audience to think, but it's really, it's making me mad. I'm, I'm, I need to switch to the next, su to the next subject. Alright, so in the next section, we're going to be talking about like his whole format of his all like every single one of his videos how they're formatted so what i'm talking about is how he has the same intro this like the same 3d intro he's had it for like i don't even know how long the same thumbnails like don't even change it up a little bit i know other youtubers kind of do this like uh vanos and stuff like that where they have the gta thumbnails that are like colorful and stuff but i'm this is a lot worse than that so, also, in his videos, he has the same music. Like, I'm not even... I'm not even kidding. Like, if you go through his videos, you'll hear that whatever song it's called, it's the same thing. The same music. Every video, played from the start all the way to the end. Same music. So, I don't know. He's not really being... I don't know why he keeps doing this. It's not really that annoying, but, like, maybe he should try changing up a little bit it's triggering me oh i almost i just i can't I'm, like he doesn't have any creativity whatsoever with all of his videos like if he didn't have the same formatting the same music the same everything same thumbnails maybe they would be still okay but then again he's still clickbait and stuff like if every day if i did the same thing for my videos they were all the same map on Black Ops 3 or something like that, doing the same thing as I always do, it wouldn't be that great, right? Nobody would like it. Then why does he keep doing it? It's just really, it's triggering me. Another part about this guy's channel that really annoys me is the comment section. Like, not only is it, like, filled with the same stuff that every other video on the internet is filled with, all the copy and paste memes or whatever, but it's also filled with probably young children that are like really happy that he made the how to get free game tutorials. Like they never knew that the free games on the PlayStation Store section even existed. Like I don't know if they're real people or if there's like bots that he has. I do not know. 
but all I know is that the comment section is just really not that fun to go through and just read them all. Besides all the main points that I've made about this guy's channel, I think that might be it, but I don't know, maybe I'll make a part two or something if he ever uploads anything that's more cringy than it already is. Thanks for staying subscribed after me not uploading for two weeks. I'm actually pretty happy about that. I haven't been active very much, so I don't know how my upload schedule will be like. But I don't know. Hopefully I'll try to get back into things. So if you have any more recommendations for any of my videos, go ahead and tell me. And see you in the next video. Goodbye.